Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Lesson 2 4 multiply by 10. Greek wants to train for a race that is 10 weeks away. The chart shows his training schedule. How many miles will Greek run to train for the race? You can use patterns to find 10 times 10. Because they're running 10 miles. Okay, here we have the multiplication table of 10. So 0 times 10 equals to 10. 0 times 10 equals to 10. As we said, the property of 0, any number we multiply it by 0 equals to 0. Then 1 times 10, I multiply. I will multiply the 1 times 1 equals to 1. Then I add the 0 of the 10. It becomes 10. So, and 2 times 10. 2 times the 1 equals 2. Then the 0 of the 10, it becomes a 20. Three, the same for the others. 3 times 10. I multiply 3 times 1 equals a 3. And the zero of the 10, it becomes 30. And so on. 4 times 10 equals 40. 5 times 10 equals 50. 6 times 10 equals 60. 7 times 10 equals 70. Till 9 times 10 equals 90. Then how to find 10 times 10? I will multiply 10 times 1 equals to 10. Then the zero of the 10 I added, it becomes 100. So 10 times 10 equals to 100. So use patterns to find the product. Write the factor you multiply, you are multiplying by 10. Write a zero to the right of the factor. So a multiply of 10 will always have a zero in the one's place. So 10 times the 1 equals 10. Then the 0 of the 10, you, I add it, so it becomes 100. So Greg will run 100 miles. Let's solve question number 1. Question number 1 said, is 91 a multiple of 10? Explain. So. As we know, 9 times 10 equals to 9 times 1 equals to 9 with the 0, 90. And 10 times 10 equals 2. 10 times 1 equals 10 with the 0, 100. So is the 91 a multiple of 10? No, it's not a multiple of 10. Question number three to six, find each product. Two times one, two times one, how much equals to two? With a zero, it becomes 20. Same for number four, six times 10, six times one equals to six. With a zero equals to 60. Eight times 10 e equals to how much? Eight times one equals to eight. With the zero, it becomes 80. Same for question number six. Nine times 10 equals to, nine times one equals to nine. With the zero, it becomes 90. It becomes 90. So if you multiply any one digit number, any one digit like number one, number two, number three, one digit, number four, number five, number six, number seven, eight, and nine. If you multiply any number digit by 10, what do you write in the tens digit of the product? In the tens digit, you write the number that you multiplied by 10. For example, if I choose one digit number, for example, five times 10. So in the tens place, you have to write the five, and in the ones place, you have to write the zero. 